Hey guys, welcome back to Tech Love Vachetan Snowy and today we're gonna install Maxify ROM version 2.0 on the Galaxy S6 Edge SMG925F. So the Nexify ROM is a AOSP based ROM so we're just gonna install that and see how it looks and uh, how it works so to do that we're just gonna turn off our device and we're gonna go in custom recovery and to do that we're just gonna press volume up key home key and power key at the same time and now we're gonna let go of the power key So I've already made a tutorial about how to root your device and how to install a TWRP custom recovery on your device and link to that video will be down in the description so you can see how to install it if you have not installed it yet. So we're gonna go in wipe and we're gonna go in advanced wipe and we're gonna select the Dalvik ART cache system data and cache once again. We're gonna wipe and go back, back, and we're gonna go in install, and we're gonna select the Nexify 2.0, and we're gonna swipe to confirm flash. It is installing the ROM now. So it is showing that the first reboot may take some time and it may loop a few times so no need to worry about that and we're gonna reboot the system now so as the device is rebooting let's talk about the rom now so the roms come with the android and emojis it ha already has the wiper for android and dolby atmos installed in it the google app has been replaced to the stock one it has the google lila google messenger Google Calendar, Google Keyboard from Android and Nougat once again, Google Chrome, Good Lock System UI with 3 minute option, uh, it has Google Play Music, Samsung Camera, it has the stock Samsung Camera and uh, multi window support is there and display scaling option is there which is really nice to have if you like to scale down your or scale up your screen which I really like to do and that are just some features of this ROM so it looks just like the stock android and it is a little bit nice so we're just gonna wait for it to boot up and let's see what's what so the main thing about this ROM is that it comes pre-installed with the Google Apps and you do not have to flash some zip file to get the Google Apps or gaps so that is a nice feature in this ROM and most of the ASP based ROM does not come with the Google app so you have to flash a zip to get the Google app. So the device just booted up and it looks just like the stock Samsung uh, setup and so we're just gonna set up the device. So the device is set up and the one thing I would like to tell you is that the phone looks really clean and the best thing that I liked about this till now is that that the keyboard feels really amazing the keyboard feels really amazing to type upon so as you can see this is the notification bar and it is giving me uh, a little tutorial so we're gonna skip that and that is the Google dialer messenger and there's the uh, app drawer and it, the ROM is crazy fast just look at it you know just you just press the app drawer icon and it just lies open and it is really fast and you also have the Chrome and we're gonna okay 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 too much information at one time so so all the applications just flies out that is amazing and the camera is from the S6 normal S6 camera which is uh, really okay and the quick launch also works so and as you can see just the app draw just uh, flies open and the one thing I'm not liking about this ROM is that this pink and purple whatever the color is the 
I need to change that it just doesn't look that appealing to me and let's check out the lock screen so it is a good lock so the lock screen looks amazing I like the lock screen and let's turn up the brightness a little bit so let's go into settings and check uh, the settings and the settings are from the normal galaxy s6 edge and that too from the marshmallow so software info the android version is 6.0.1 the kernel is permissive so that should work nice and easy and the viper for android is installed and you do have some samsung applications like video my files and samsung uh, smart manager you do have some files and i must say that i am really liking this rom and i don't think it has the google assistant but there's a way around for that and now that i've got this asp based rom so i'm gonna create a tutorial on how to install uh, android assistant on any uh, device running marshmallow and I have got a uh, no good ROM for the Galaxy S3 as well So I will make a video on how to install Google Assistant on any Android device running no good as well So I think that's it and thanks for watching and and if you like this video Please give it a thumbs up and if you're new here, please subscribe to the channel and the review for this ROM will be out in a couple of days And thanks for watching guys